Hey guys, it's Louise here and welcome back to my channel. So today we have episode 5 of Lord of the Rings, The Rings of Power, season 2. That's a lot of words. Um, I have been thinking about this. I had to stop recording yesterday, like I was re recording uh, the, the previous couple of episodes all at once. And I had to stop and it drove me insane. Um, I've been thinking about it all night. I cannot wait to get back into it. Um, I, I, it's just so good. It's so fucking good. I don't care what anyone says. I love this show so much. Let's go. <laughs> you know, it's been great being able to binge like the first, uh, the first couple of episodes all at once. But now that I'm catching up on it, it's going to be so difficult to wait each week. I can't remember. I don't know how many episodes there's supposed to be in this season. Um, but my god. Oh, that's cool. Their transitions are always so cool and so smooth. Like from like the transitions from the maps into things and that was cool. That was a very pretty ring. You know, I don't know if I trust him to be the one to wear it. Although they've got quite a few, so who... I mean, I assume Durin's gonna get one. I hope. Oh man, I don't know if I trust him. As you can see, we're attempting to take a new access shaft from as far on every effort to zoom Maybe the ring will guide them to where the sunlight will be. Dig here. Nice. That's a foundation wall. Take it down. Are you explaining Delvecraft to me? Give me your axe. Father. Axe! I mean, Sauron did touch the ring, right? So maybe it's like he's trying. He's like, oh, let's let's make the ring go to here, which is the complete wrong place, and everything's gonna cave in. Although I guess he still needs him to tr them to trust him. They need to trust the ring for a little bit longer than just five minutes. Damn, he's just straight up doing it himself. He doesn't even care. Sire, don't you think you better stop for some air? It's not air we need. I mean, if the whole thing caves in, you're gonna get light. Oh, Jesus. Fair enough. Yeah, Sauron needs them to trust Next the ring time first. I ordered you to dig. Well, this is nice, at least for now. There we go. That's so cool. Behold! The doors of Durin. <laughs> The new west gate of our mountain. Speak, friend, and enter. Unbreachable, visible only by moonlight, and guarded by a password known only to friends. Now take note, Smiths. That's so Watch exciting. <laughs> very closely while he... What's wrong with you, Grumpy? I do not recall you saying that. You do not always listen. Do you have an idea set in your head? Stop manipulating the, the poor man! Longer to credit your contributions. I find it difficult to stay festive when those most affected by Morador's rise are still suffering. It is a game you play, is it not? Sowing seeds in others' minds and then convincing them that the fruit is of their own thought. 
I thought our minds were as one in this. This is a night for dwarves. Come, we shall speak of men tomorrow. Oh, he has a strict schedule to stick I would to, though. I to speak of them now. I fear Numenor more than any land in Middle Earth. I had hoped our rings might make her stable. We cannot give rings to men. The risk of corruption is simply too great. Whatever problems we might solve would be nothing against those we could create. Yes, but when the darkness falls, there are always some who rise forth and shine. Eärendil, Tur, Beren, son of Barahir. Aaron Dill name drop. Trust. The wisest, the most noble, the purest of heart from Numenor to Rune. Why is he so close to his face? Nine ring Chill, bro. For the nine greatest mortal kingdoms. My answer is no. The rings of power, if you please. Of course. Don't do it, Celebrimbor. Don't give in. I shall make the nine myself. Oh. <laughs> that, that change on his face. Oh my God. He's such a good actor. The scepter is what you make it. The age of men is upon us, father. Let us take it. Let us build the Numenor you have always seen in your mind's eye. I don't trust these two. At all. Once, when you were at her breast, your mother prophesied that you would come to ill ends. For the queen. These are the only two that I trust to have the rings. And a Sildur, but, Comes well, actually, no. No, we don't trust the Sildur with the ring. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Together. Lieutenant. What's the meaning of all this? Anyone deemed loyal to the Queen Regent has been stripped of rank. On whose authority? Yikes. On mine. Oh, you silly bitch. God, I hit him. Ugh. Captain leaving deck. He's nobody's captain now. Oh, shut up. Slap him in the face. He's right. I'm not. Captain. Thank you, Captain. The Valar protects you. That's enough. Thank you, Captain. Thank you, Captain. Well, I'll bless you, Captain. Thank you, Captain. Thank you, Captain. Thank you, Captain. Oh, I love him. That's enough. Thank you, Captain. How do you think this ends? Silence. Nobody's going to listen to you, you little shit. You're one of my oldest friends. I think you've made it clear enough who your friends are. Cope and seethe, bitch. Cope and seethe. God damn it, someone punched them all in the face. Most noble High King. As requested, the forge is dark and the workshop you is You lying piece of shit. A precious calm has settled over the city and I foresee brighter days. I mean, he's not really a piece of shit. I love him. I hope you are able to make a visit soon. And whilst we hesitate, Adar's army grows stronger by the day. It's perfect. Mm -hmm. 200 for that one. 200? 
for a bloody rock. It's a tuning crystal. I don't care if it's a cart and six horses. I won't pay it. <laughs> the king's new law. <laughs> Hundred and fifty. Nice. <laughs> I mean, it is very pretty. Very pretty. It's rolling. <laughs> it's rolling. You seem to have kicked it. Where the fuck did Durin go? Oh god, that's rolling so far. Oh, this worries me. Where the fuck did it go? Why did it roll so far? Please be care. Oh, this is so claustrophobic. Please be careful. Um... Was that? Emissaries of the Seven Dwarven Realm should be delving much deeper. What? Who set these restrictions? Well, you did, sir. Decades ago. What is it? Uh, you took it off. What is it? You, what have you done with it? That's there, sire. You, you took it off. You said your hand was feeling heavy. Here comes the addiction to it. Stop! There's something under the mines. Disa heard it herself. A nameless evil. Ancient and powerful. You mustn't dig. You have your orders, Del Master. All right, if y'all want to get eaten by a you. Balrog, don't do it. Del Master, you have your orders. Come on, you know there's something sus about this, man. Disa is mistaken. It is no danger. Bro is shocked beyond belief. It's annoying as well because we know that there's something there. And we're like, just believe them! But obviously he's not gonna fucking believe them. We were casting a new design for a ring. Verdanio is attempting to resize it. It's the one ring. <laughs> oh, that poor girl. I saw I At first, I thought it was the forge, burning. It was tall. And its skin was made of flames. It came toward me, breathing. Reeking of death, and I swore I... I think it's been here among us all along. You are with us now. There is nothing to fear. Why are they not sus of him? Around. What did you do differently this time? So we sought to fortify the alloy by adding more mithril. No, no. If you'd wanted to do that, you should have. You, you. Sneaky motherfucker. It would save us immeasurable hours of toil if you would offer this one single word of counsel. God, he's so fucking good at manipulating this pissing me off <laughs> at this point he's forced into it uh oh you should... he says it is urgent something about the rings what 
I will see what he wants. No. No. I will go. Well done, Kellebrimbor. Is it possible? The ring he's wearing. No. We used the same process. The eyebrow raise. Good, and the same materials, even the same tools as for the three. Yeah, but someone else touched but it this time. There be a, a, a fault in your rings. The fault in our rings. <laughs> New TV show. Then maybe the faults in the ring make him. How much do you really know about this, Arnatar? Come on, Calibrimbor, you know. Oh, he knows he's being watched. Oh, that's so eerie. You are very brave. Some who behold the unseen world. Oh, here he goes, flirting his way in. This one again. You, you speak of Lord Calibrimbor? Yes. Toll that creation has exacted from him in crafting the three and the seven has left him diminished, vulnerable to the shadow. Yo, he's sowing them seeds. How strange when the light caught your hair for a moment, you seemed her perfect likeness. His likeness. Galadriel. My Lady Galadriel's, of course. God damn, I mean, honestly, he would win me over. Like, he would win me over so easily. I'm not. I can't deny it. He could just look at me, and I'd be gone. God, I hope he finds a Sildur soon. This shrine is condemned by order of the king. Return to your homes. My son, this is the oldest shrine in Numenor. King sends his apologies. Someone dunk him in the water. You heard him, old man. Ow. Give him the relic. Oh, he's going to smash it, isn't he? I don't know if you're aware, but I've been promoted to- Get absolutely fucked, you little bitch boy. So worth it. The shrine is for the faithful. May the Valar forgive me. For what? No! Honestly, absolute king. He slays. Come on, throw him in the water. Throw him in the water. Not him. The other one. No. Stop. No. Stop. Fucking Jesus, thank God. Bro's in sin. No! Blondeel, put it down. Put it down, son. That's an order. Honestly, though, fair play to him. I love him so Our much.
Inform the jailer. He was the one who started the uprising. No, no, I tell you, there is something wrong with that. As one who so masterfully manipulates metal, just be mindful someone is not manipulating you. You see, Dagger. Says you, enough, bitch. You ignore them until they are right at your throat. No, enough. Did you, in some way, alter the dwarven rings, yes or no? No. We did. What are you talking about? The letter. Oh. You lied. That was not a lie. Your High King consented to the three. But the seven. We forged beneath. Bro. Oh, he's so you sneaky. He would never permit me to forge anything again it is either that or we plunge straight on even deeper into the maelstrom father i have been to Eregion. i tell you some devilry has gone into these rings father i am proud of you oh. i am proud of you your desire to partner with the elves has saved our kingdom now more than ever. This is how you know it's it's fucking him up. I need your axe by my side. You have my axe. <laughs> Prince Doran. Fuck. Oh, oh my god, this music is fucking intense, bro. I will say it again as I say it always. Bear, you fucking killed it. I tried. But didn't know. I tried to tell him. I hope this doesn't cause a rift between them. Swear to me that you will never wear one of those rings. He's already wearing one, isn't he? No. I swear it. I... I trust him. There is agency uncanny. We must atone for our mistakes. In the only way we can, by... Completing the rings together. We shall work night and day. New designs, new alloys, a, a new process. And any of you who offer so much as a hair's breadth less than his utmost effort is a, a smith of a region no longer. Fuck. It starts now. Christ. Oh, I don't like this version of you, Celebrimbor. Your master may seem unreasonable. Yet I know you will not disappoint me. Never mind. I think I'm certain Ooh. that we will complete the rings of power. Dude, when he finds out, oh my god. You know, if only Elrond and Galadriel had arrived by now, but of course, no, because that was all in his plan, that they wouldn't arrive. Ah! High King, the orcs are not in Mordor. A legion of them are headed for Eregion. Galadriel was right. You must send the army to Eregion this moment. That will not be possible. I have reason to believe that Sauron is the architect of all this. Region is the very jewel of Elvendom. 
If it were to fall, it would be a mortal blow for all in Middle Earth. You must send aid. Our armies cannot defeat both Adar and Sauron. Oh. Interesting to see her work with Adar. Oh, he's gonna be pissed. Oh, he's gonna be pissed. <laughs> oh, dude, he's gonna be so mad when he. I don't know if it was part of his plan to get her with Adar. I don't think it would be. Maybe he thought that he would just kill them, but like, if he finds out that her and Adar are helping each other. I feel like if that wasn't part of his plan, he's going to be fuming. He's going to be like, bitch, what the fuck? That's my woman. <laughs> oh God, I need, I, I'm, oh God, I need the next episode immediately. I'm so glad I didn't have to wait a week for the next one, but then I'm going to have to wait another week for the next one, which is going to be painful. But, oh, that was a, that was a tough episode. Fucking, I'm so pissed at little bitch boy. Why did he kill him? Why? What was- why was that necessary? I mean, I get it, but like... I really thought- I really thought he was okay. They baited us with the death, with him drawing in. And then he backed away, and then... Uh, I'm so upset. Isildur, come back and help everybody! <laughs> oh, God. This is so upsetting. That was such an upsetting episode. And Celebrimbor, man, I just want to squeeze his cheeks and give him a little hug because, like, he just deserves so much better. And I love Anatar. I love Sauron. I love Halbranch. But, like, buddy, come on, please. Not Celebrimbor. He's just a little guy. <laughs> but, yeah, I'm very, I'm very excited to see what happens with Galadriel and Adar. I'm, I think that's going to be an interesting partnership. And I don't know where it could lead, but I kind of hope that they do partner up and she's like, yeah, I know where Sauron is. And he's like, I fucking knew it. I had him in my grasp. I could have got rid of him. Um, so that's going to be interesting. So I'm just going to shut up and get straight into the next episode because I'm excited. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. So peace.